It's a really nice word, unforgettable. Just think how many students have been in my classroom, are going to graduate, go out into the world, and they'll always look back to me. That gives me chills to think that I'll be an unforgettable teacher. I just want students to remember me that I'm no different. I'm a deaf teacher, and I'm a proud deaf teacher, but I just speak a different language. It's really great to have deaf teachers because they teach language from the source, not from a hearing teacher who teaches it and it's their second language and they're limited to what they can teach. But having a deaf teacher that eats, breathes, and sleeps sign language 24 seven, we're not only teaching language, but we're also teaching how to interact, how to behave as a deaf person, how to view a deaf person. And I'm also teaching people with people with disabilities, there's no different. We're all the same. So I'm living proof that you and I are no different. I love it when I look at my students and I see the light bulb come on. I see my students using the language to their advantage. They'll go to another classroom and use American Sign Language and other teachers will come up and say, you know, your ASL students are using sign language. I told them to be quiet, so they switched over to signing. <laughs> and I didn't mean that, I meant silence altogether. So I love it when I hear stories like that. Just looking at someone, um, you think you might know their life, but in, if I didn't impact them, I would feel like I didn't do my job. But if they take this on and change the way they behave, I feel like I've done my job. If I can help one deaf person's life be better, then I've done my job well.